You like this change of location? This is welcome to my pantry. Um, we got some canned goods down here, and then we got some goods up here. And then we got some bread right here, because that's how we're living. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Erica. I hope you are all doing well and I'm sending nothing but good vibes your way. So, I've been watching how the videos on YouTube of Get Ready With Me on Valentine's Day. And though, um, those are really cute. But I'm single and I'm not going out on Valentine's Day. But, I thought because... You know, everyone's going out and having a joyous, merry time with their significant other. I would put an application in for mine. I thought, since everybody's getting all ready for Valentine's Day, I would do a fay application. Just in case somebody is looking for a Valentine and they want to stumble upon my video. Well, it's called, this is on my Kindle. I'll let you see that. But it's the cuddle application. And basically it's for those lonely and cold people who need a cuddle buddy. That sounds desperate as hell. <laughs> First question is your name? Well, if you click on this video, you will look down below and say my name is Erica the Awkward Marie. You can just call me Awkward. You can just call me Marie or Miss Miller if you're nasty. Age. I am um, the young age of... 22 no I just had a birthday I'm 23 jeez I don't know my own age guys I'm sorry um gender OG like literally original gangster on my birth certificate pull it out it'd be like OG yeah no um I'm a female of course I got the boobs to prove it phone number is 1-800-GET-YOUR-WIFE because why would I say that? Unless you really want my phone number you can go slide in my DMs. Address 5572 Over the Rainbow Avenue Never Never Land South Pole That's that's where I live. I live in the South Pole Antarctica in Never Never Land You gotta take you got, as soon as you get to the rainbow you gotta go over the rainbow and you're gonna meet this dude with some lucky charms say no because he's gonna try to get you to chase him if you say yes so go past that nigga and then you're gonna see this big ass sign that says never never land and that's where you want to be okay and then just look for me i'm outside most of the time working the corner trying to sell my pantry not my body my pantry top five movies top five movies i have a lot of movies i think i can't think of them like right off the bat but i do love 21 jump street that is literally one of my favorite movies i loved aladdin when i was little so if you want to have disney and chill aladdin aladdin um batman probably um what's it dark knight rises number four you know what's a really good feel-good movie is Chef. So I would actually watch that multiple times. And the fifth one? I don't know. What you like, boo? I am like, whatever you want to watch. Because I'm a supportive thing. Five random facts about me. I'm really shy, but I'm friendly. Uh, I love music. I literally love music. I literally love when people put me on to new music. So if you're my bae and you introduce me to somebody that I don't know and he's just dope or they're dope or whatever, I'm into that. Like, I love all music. I love animals. I love my cats. They're literally like, even though they can't stand to be around me sometimes, they're literally my children. I'm a giver. Like, even if I say I won't give you $5, I will give you $5 plus tax because I just won't feel right afterwards. And number five... I'm very patient. I'm too patient, actually. I'm too patient and I'm too nice because you could shit on me three times and I'll still be really nice to you and patient with you. So, I guess those are my five thingies. You mind if I give you a cute nickname? If you want to give me a cute nickname, 
go for it because I don't think I've ever had a cute nickname besides the ones that my sisters have given me. So if you want to call me your little snuggle fritz or <laughs> or your little uh your little Brooklyn net, go for it. Go for it. I'm all for it. Can we build a fort? Um, that's like a rhetorical question. Fuck yes, we could build a fort. Like challenge that's what i want to do with my life is build a fort over a fucking tv we could just have netflix and fort all day and bug out you know what i'm saying um will there be random junk food and food fights i mean i think in my pantry we got pretty healthy stuff we do got some generic popcorn over here i mean we got chocolate syrup I mean, we could use that for something. Um, we got some oatmeal. I don't see no junk food in here, though. So, we have to go to the store for that. Um, so, if you want to go to the store and get some junk food, I'm with it. But, uh, food fights, they take a lot of time and effort to wash this weed. So, unless you want to sit here and help me pick out the food particles and the speckles, there ain't going to be no food fight, man. Unless you want to help me. If you want to help me pick out the food parts and speckles, we can do it. Do you, do you mind kissing? I mean, if you're going to be my bae, I think, like, we should totally kiss, like... Not only the ones, like twice, maybe three times, because third time's the charm. So yeah, I don't mind if we have. It says include one or all, your Instagram, or your Tumblr, or your Twitter. Well, to be honest, everything is online, Erica. So if you want to get at me, that's my that's my handles. All right, those are my handles. Insert a photo of yourself here. So I guess if I had to take a photo, it'd be like. No, or that wasn't exactly. <laughs> that wasn't cute. That was actually really, really bad. And put your signature. So, but yeah, that's my bay slash cuddle application. Um, yeah, I just thought it'd be fun to do since you know. I'm single and everything. But thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to go uh, follow me on my social medias. They're all on that Erica for everything. I do love you and I hope you do have a dope ass time in this universe. And uh, check out my other videos. Alright, we get to pop in. If you haven't hit that subscribe button, you should do it now. Because, you know, that's, that's what friends are for. We can be together on Valentine's. Okay. Stay mama shit, yo. Bye. I'm over here telling myself, like, what the f Erica, why do you still like this nigga? I had to be open and honest with them. I had to let him know, like, yo, I don't know what it is, but I really dig you, yo, and I don't get it. I don't, I don't get why I like you. And he's like, yo, I don't get why you like me either. Cause, and I'm just like... <laughs> nigga, I don't know either.